Hi, I'm Kiki from Kika Goods. Today we are going to unbox Farmer Bob Next Generation Pixel Universe Series Blind Box. Before diving in, let's see the previous Farmer Bob series. You can get them from our online store. And don't forget to hit subscribe button in the lower right corner for more unboxing reviews. This time, Bob takes us into the new era of the Pixel Universe. So, have you ever wondered what the future world will look like? Now, let's get started and open these up. As we can see, this is how the box looks. Bob's design on the cover looks incredibly cool. It has 18 regular styles and 6 surprise styles, also with two hidden figures. I'm excited to display the details. Okay, the first one. Let's see who's in this one. Wow, we start with the deer in prison, even better than what expected. Oh, I find it even a special color style. Bob's head is made of a material with a tactile finish. And what really stands out is the black crown. Small, exquisite, and very cool. For his body, I can't believe it has transformed into a silver cage with a pixel heart clearly visible inside. He also has black pixel wings. It's not a little bit cool. What I want to say is that he seems to be a sprite of the night. So impressed by this one. I have to say this design is full of amazing details. Okay, let's continue. Okay, look at this one. He's a really, really cool figure. Bob is holding an umbrella and wearing a raincoat. It reminds me of a hacker from the movies. Instead of raindrops, streams of programming code fall from the sky, featuring only the numbers 1 and 2, giving it a strong tech vibe. And the detail in the raincoat is stunning, which is covered in blue glitter. Somehow, I'm obsessed with this color because it is very cool. This is definitely a figure I highly recommend. Now, box number three. So do you know this one? I know it's very popular in this series. We can see on top of his head is a small pixelated sun, which looks very warm and pretty. True to its name, this one has a rainbow cascading from its chest, which is truly beautiful. I do feel it's a bold design in this series. Unlike the pixel elements, the cloud backpack on his back is made of flocked material, which is fluffy and it feels very comfortable to touch. So, I think the whole sky is on his body, I do appreciate it. Honestly, this bob is a very soothing design. Here we have number four. I'm sure we got the holy angel. Actually, this one is so simple, but super adorable. The overall color scheme is mint green, which is very refreshing and perfect for summer. You can see, there are feather designs on his head and chest. When it comes to angel feathers, I see them as symbols of purity and freedom. The coolest part is the gradient pixel wings on his back, which are transparent, and I imagine they would look amazing under the lights. This is like the meeting of an angel and a demon, and which one do you prefer? Once again, this design is truly fantastic. All right, moving on to our next blind box. I'm excited, you know. 
This one is the surrounding sound figure. Bob is surrounded by a giant treble clef, in my opinion, which exudes a strong sense of freedom. Here, his body has many astonishing material details. You can see a tactile head, a gradient colored body, and jelly-like musical notes. This small figure incorporates many different elements, including golden musical notes and a red note on top of his head. Honestly, I am very satisfied with this design. Sincerely, I want to gift this to a friend who plays music. Now, turning our attention to this one. We got the Lucky Koi. I believe that you will definitely fall in love with it. Firstly, the color combination is perfectly balanced and very captivating. What's surprising is that, if you look closely, you can see cloud motifs with traditional Chinese elements on his body. Truly a fascinating blend of technology and tradition. I love this koi design. It has a wonderful meaning. You can see he has more than one koi on him, which is really exciting to see. I think many people would love to have this one. Do you think so? So, I hope this koi can bring good luck to you guys. Okay, what kind of surprise will this figure bring to me? You know we got this one, Desert Oasis. This looks amazing. And the colors are so pretty. A cactus grows from his head, as if sprouting from a rock, which is incredibly cute. The design of his outfit is especially cool. I love this zipper. That reminds me of a cracked desert. It's very interesting. And from these cracks, pixelated green leaves emerge with a transparent and jelly-like texture, creating a contrast with the body material. Oh, and there are also some butterflies, which I love. So far, I really like all of them. Which detail of this figure is your favorite? Next box. I am so curious about this one. Oh, I'm sure we got the cheese figure. All right. Bob transformed into a big piece of cheese. Unlike others, this entire figure is made of a material with a tactile finish. You can see, his face and clothes are designed to look like cheese, also complete with cheese holes. I'm amazed at here the Pac-Man is passing through his body and how perfectly the cheese and Pac-Man elements blend together. There's also a purple Pac-Man ghost on his head, super adorable. Okay, let's see. He has a pixelated trail on his back, which looks super cool and reminds me of Pixel Wars in movie. This design is incredibly captivating, and I absolutely love it. Up next. Okay, look at this. It's the cold outside, hot inside figure. I really like this design. We can see the entire figure is made from transparent material. So obviously, the upper part resembles burning flames in pixel style with a small flame on his head. Here, the back of his head even features a scar expression, which is incredibly cool. And the lower part, I think, looks like melting glaciers, crystal clear and very sci-fi. The merging section in the middle turns into soft yellow with a jelly-like texture, which is really beautiful. I'm very fond of this design concept. Okay, the last one in the whole set.
The last one is about forest. Compared to the desert oasis, this one seems to symbolize invasion. I mean, his entire head is infested with pixelated forests. The pixel elements are more prominent here, including Bob's feet, his heart, and even his head. On his head, there's a bird's nest and eggs, which blend perfectly with nature. His body has transformed into a pixelated tree, and the red heart might also be a fruit grown from the tree. It's truly a fascinating design. So, which one in this series impressed you the most? Thank you so much for watching our blind box unboxing video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to smash that like button and share it with your fellow collectors. And of course, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more unboxing content. This is Kiki from Kika Goods. See you next time.